Hello, Old School Gamer 1971 here. Greetings, one and all, especially to you, Millie and Lloyd. Today, my third hour thoughts is on Unravel 2. I've been playing this game for over three hours, and this is what I think. So, Unravel 2 by Coldwood Interactive on PlayStation 4 in 2018, and it's a platform Avenger. You again play Yarnit. However, this time there is two of them. This is unfortunate where the plot ends, so let's see what else the game has under the hood. You see a stormy ocean with a small cabin boat with Yarny on the deck. Suddenly a huge wave slams into the side of the boat and it capsizes. Yarny is thrown a long way from the boat. He is still attached when the yarn snaps and a wave crashes over his head, knocking him unconscious. He awakes on the beach. You connect with a blue yarner, and then the game begins. Right, so let me start by saying I loved the first game. It was a damn fine game. This game, the controls are tighter. The physics engine is crazy. I don't mean crazy in a bad way or stupid. I mean, considering this is a 2D platformer, the physics and the way in which it moves is pretty damn good. And its gameplay matches it all really well. It delivers gameplay in spades. The two yarn is connected adds to the game so much. It's so much fun, it brings a new dynamic to the game. It can get a little bit trickier, but it never stops being fun. The action is fast and fluid. Graphics and musicality are spot on here. Whilst it's hard to bring atmosphere to a 2D platformer where you are made of yarn, somehow though it works and it all seems to come together. So graphically, wow, just wow. This is 2D, but the graphics look so damn good. It's so detailed. From the opening storm to the kids' playground and beyond, I cannot praise Coldwood Interactive enough. It looks outstanding, fast-paced, everything a 2D platformer should be. The music really fits the game as well. The sound is also well done. It really adds to the atmosphere. From the first beat I sat up and took notice. As scenes change, so does the music. It's spot on almost at every turn.
so after three hours this is a great single player game but it's better in co-op it is a vast improvement over the original when they announced this and it was on the store I didn't really care next game I will be so that about wraps it up I hope you are all okay and have a good day and if this has been helpful in any way like subscribe comment or share it helps the channel grow and makes an old man very happy old school gamer 1971 signing off